Hey everybody, we're back with a, another Dokkan video, and today, a little behind on all of this, the easy A's and stuff. Uh, been trying to get more recording it, but today we're going to be doing the Goku easy A. So we're going to be using a full power Frieza team, pretty much. The only one that's not on there is the uh, in third form Frieza. But the reason why I'm using the team is for the most fact that full power leaders are quite hard to find. You know, Tech Super Saiyan 4 Goku got his easy A, but not many people run that anymore. So, as a substitute for the whole thing, it's better to just get, I think, Frieza. Because AGL Frieza can just wipe, the, wipe Goku out on his own. I mean, if you're having a, a hard time maybe potentially finding full power leaders, like STR, full power Frieza, or... The tech Super Saiyan 4 Goku, I think AGO Frieza is a, a good bet. Especially because he can additional against uh, pure Saiyans. But being on the JP side, the my understanding of a lot of the translations are, are, are different. Especially because I don't look a lot of them up. So it just mostly bases off of memory, but for the most fact, he's pretty good. And I think we Yeah, we clear here. So for the most part, I think the Intelligent Super Saiyan 3 Frieza is going to be like the the unit we kind of have to baby the most, just for the fact that he can get hit for a lot, especially if it's a super. Uh, there's no chance of surviving that. Oh well, unless he dodges. At least he's able to dodge that super. Oh, okay, I'll take the Kai's. I'll take the uh, yeah, I'll take the Kai's. So it's just yeah, it's just a lot better to find them. And especially with the celebration going on right now with the uh, the worldwide celebration, it's a lot easier to find the freezes because he's on the banner now and the friends change. But for a while, I wasn't able to find any, or maybe because of the level. I know level can really depend on what you can find. The higher level you are, the, the easier it is to maybe find like a rainbow Frieza or whatnot. Even like a rainbow Super Saiyan for Goku might be a little easier to find. But uh, as far as my experience goes it's it's very difficult because a lot of people oof, that's a lot of damage a lot oh dodge uh <laughs> a lot of people that i get as friends now are mostly whatever unit is the most popular but i feel like the higher level you are because not many people get there it's more diverse with friends get those additional and he's not getting attacked in the last slot which is good and I think Frieza can perform up to three additional attacks which have a chance to become super attack and then whatever his passive is mine's rainbow oddly but you know never able to pull the uh, in Goku still trying still unsuccessful but you know We'll get there. We'll get there one day. I think we clear here. I think it's uh Oh no, okay. 8.5. Oh yeah, additional. 5.5, okay. And yeah, there we go. So, you know, as you can see, just being in a, a lower level kind of status, it is quite harder to find Rainbow Friends. I mean, you know, Ginyu's pretty good, but only if you really have the support for him. Uh, uh, you know, I don't know who put that not in the top right path, but uh, please don't. 
But you know, 79% isn't bad. It'll get the job done. I mean, mine's, I believe, only 55%. Yeah, mine's only 55%. He's doing pretty well. I mean, against a pure Saiyan, they're gonna, I believe, crit anyway, so it's quite good, but you know. But this easy I shouldn't be too bad. And I especially like Goku because when he transforms, I, I just learned this, but when he transforms, he, uh, he raises defense, he stacks. Which, as a, a stacking advocate, I love. Because, you know, I believe, like, ever since Ultimate Gohan, the, the, the tech Ultimate Gohan that transforms, he uh, he's, like, my favorite unit. Just for the due fact that he stacks. And I mean, 30% on this. Or what was it? 30% guard and then stacks, which is amazing. And I mean, sure, it's a 130% it's a to... Uh, I believe HP and then 170 to attack and defense, which is is quite low. And I mean, in today's meta, you kind of need a 170 or even a 200% leader. But when he gets his easy A, I believe at least he would get an easy A just for the do fact that to boost him up to a 170 lead, you don't really have to touch anything else on him. Like you can leave the super attack alone. The passive is pretty good. I mean, you can maybe buff the passive, but he's already quite broken. I mean, you can use him in a lot of events today, so just to beef him up further would feel kind of unnecessary, but I mean, I wouldn't mind maybe a little more defense in the passive, attack in the passive, but regardless, in really long events, he does great. In short events, it's quite hard, but not too hard. I mean, on a 55% level, might be a little difficult, but if you have like a dupe or two in him, that first super attack will get his defense to a well enough point where you don't really need to worry about him anymore but so that's why i really like the goku because he stacks defense i mean 77 percent or health below would be quite difficult to get just today for the fact that again a lot of characters stack so he so would he and to the due fact that it just be a lot of defense that it might be hard to get to that 77% of below health, which was 70% before, but. Sorry if I went super quiet there. I, uh, or actually, I'm, uh, yeah. I just wanted to, to play Golden Freeze's intro because I don't really see it quite often, so I wanted to play it for the, the video, but it was quite nice. But anyways, uh, Hopefully we can get Frieza's active skill here. Yeah, AGL Frieza, full power Frieza. I want to, I want to try to get his active skill, but we'll see. But uh, yeah, having his his defense stack is great, but uh, everyone else stats as well would be quite ideal though to have everybody on a more than fifty five percent. Just if you're doing like the cell max event, he'd be quite good on uh, on a defensive like point. But I feel like if a lot of your units are only 55%, that 77% health or below wouldn't be quite difficult to reach. You know, I I will buy some stones and I'll summon, but for the most part, a lot of my units are 55%. I only ever go for the single unit. Oh, okay, we're getting super here. Oh, it's not gonna do it. It's not gonna do anything. So, you know, yeah, 98 damage real far. <laughs> so, you know, for the most part, it's... I feel like for a lot of players that aren't, you know, wailing out in the game, having a couple of units here and there who are 55%, if you go into a difficult event, it wouldn't be too hard to get to that 77% or below mark. And then you just, he transforms uh, on the third turn, or after the third, uh, from the third turn on, any point of 77%. I believe, 
correct me if I'm wrong, that he will transform, which is quite nice. I mean, it can help a lot in a lot of events, but if you do any of like the, the red zone, you would have to stack him to a point where he would be, where you would be comfortable having him in like, Maybe the second slot, first slot. He might be first slot if the defense is high enough, but it'd be quite difficult to get him to a, a comfortable point of... Uh, hold on, let me change the settings so we won't see freezes uh, skill again. So you just have to be uh, comfortable to a point where you, you feel like the defense is uh, large enough to hold, but... For the first few turns, he just might have to be a second or third slot unit. Well, second slot unit, because you want to stack his defense when that third turn comes around, but, you know. All in all, I think, it, I think he does well. I think he does well. And, the, you know, in the, the base, especially if you can get all in the family. If you can have a unit that has all in the family, 21% defense to both units is great. Great link, but... Without that, yeah, I believe it's 159% defense, attacking defense when he's untransformed in his base form. So getting him to stack is is kind of the goal, or at least it would be the most beneficial in hard events. Wow, 81k. Okay, I gotta pay attention. Okay, we got freezes active skill. Let's pull up. It's a nice actor skill, but for the most part, I haven't really used Frieza at least for on my end, just because he's fifty-five percent. So mine's really, I don't know, squishy in a sense. But I do like how he does stack defense as well as attack. But getting his eighteen key isn't always the easiest thing, because I know Super Saiyan Goku the. Uh, in LR1, his is stack defense on a 12 key, and he stacks attack on his 18 key. So for Frieza to be in the reverse, isn't the most difficult to get his 18 key super, like right now? But it isn't always guaranteed, which is something else entirely. But for the most part, they are very good units, and, and one day I will pull in LR Super Saiyan Goku. I will get him, because I've yet to beat... Broly. <laughs> 52k? Wow. So I really want to be Broly at some point. So that, that's, that's the dream. That's the goal. But not right now because, you know, the discounts went away on uh, Cooler's banner. So I'm tapping out on that one. But uh, summoning video will be coming up for um, Cooler. Metal Cooler. Excuse me. And the Super Saiyan Goku and Vegeta, that'll be coming up soon. But I just wanted to get a lot of the easy A's out of the way. So, probably the videos coming up are going to be AGL Metal Cool's easy A. I'm going to be wrapping that up. I'll do Full Power Frieza's easy A. And then I'm going to be doing the Virtual Clash video. Then I'll do a summoning video. Maybe in the middle of that or before even those. As like a filler. But, oh, we're going to get Frieza's easy A again. That's fine. We'll just let it play in the background. But, you know, for the most part, I'm just trying to get all that done. St uh, still looks looks like a really good unit, though. I like, I like the way that they did that. That was a nice... Yeah, that was a nice look. I, I will be shutting off the, uh, the actor's guild, though. I think we've, we've got all those bases covered, so I'm just going to be putting that on. Okay. So we get his 18 key super here. We get his 18 key. Oh, a little bit of the last slot. I think we kill here. I don't think we have to worry about third form freeze in the last slot there. I think we're we're fine. Yeah, you're gonna take double digits. Single digit? Oh, I thought maybe. <laughs> the 79% is is pretty good. 
but I feel like, you know, nowadays a lot of people want the 55% to do really well, but that's quite difficult. I, I feel like a lot of the, 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 the direction the game is going in is very, you know, duplicated, or at least it could be. A lot of the units don't really do well at 55%. They need those dupes. But, I, I mean, you know, if you're just going to play casually and just try to get into it, then yeah, 55% is great. Oh, and uh, that's it. That's the last stage. Alright, thanks for everybody who, uh, who tuned in, and I'll uh, catch you in the next one. Bye.